So today I'm going to show you how to light your A.O. Smith water heater with a Honeywell gas valve. So what you want to do is first check and see if you have any codes up here that'll show up on the status light. It'll blink white if you have codes, meaning any of these other things that happened. And it's one through eight. I have other videos on that, but let's get started on just relighting it. So first you're gonna to wanna to pay attention if your water heater was on and the wind probably blew out your pilot light. You wanna see which setting it was on, either hot, A, B, C, D, or very high, which I don't recommend. <laughs> so mine's on A, so I'm gonna remember that. So I'm gonna turn this dial all the way to off. Then I'm gonna turn it to pilot. And then once you're on pilot, you push the button in and hold it for about, oh, I, I usually do it for about 30 seconds, just to make sure. So when you push this in, it's letting more gas than normal through the pilot valve just to get it started. So once you've waited the 30 seconds, then you're going to press this button, which is the electric electronic ignition. And so you'll want to hit it once. And I usually hit it about three times just to make sure. I'll even go four. Why not? <laughs> and I still hold it for about 20 seconds after just to make sure that the the pilot light stays lit now i got the status light and i could probably turn it now saying it's blinking just once and up there that means that it's running normal so now i can move it back so i'll release the button because i'm i was still holding it in and then I'm going to turn it to A, where it was at. And I don't know if you could hear that, but my water heater just started. So that's, that's about it. Um, I have other videos about troubleshooting water heaters, if you'd like to look at those. Uh, otherwise, thanks for coming by and watching.